What's up, y'all? It's a full day of eating. Um, five days out. We're doing a mini carb load. Well, it's actually, we're pushing the carbs. So we're going to do 400 grams of carbs today, 150 grams of protein, and 60 grams of fat. I'm going to take you to a full day of eating. Sit back, relax, enjoy the episode. Let's go. When I say I'm going to do something, it's already done. I'm coming for overall Ben's Physique Champion at Summer Shredding in October 2023. This is redemption. So, you know, one, we are five days up from the show. We want to push carbs right now because I'm really lean and I want to see what the carb load is going to be like. So, meal one is going to be 23 grams of protein. 69 grams of carbs and 10 grams of fat and what we're going to eat for that is 67 grams of cream, cream of rice 50 grams of banana one tablespoon of peanut butter and one scoop of the chocolate sun warrior blend vegan protein i'm so excited this is literally double what i usually eat i did four low days in a row and i was fucking dying so this is going to be literal heaven salt cinnamon toast flavor it's fucking delicious Look at that, one scoop of protein. And again, usually I do like a quarter scoop, so having a full scoop is like, it's gonna be thick and fucking. Oh my God. I have to keep my protein intake low today. So usually I'd have like a cream of rice and like some egg whites because it like it's more satiating, but I need to keep my protein intake lower. So I'm gonna have a scoop of protein powder instead of doing like a, of egg whites. So, shows on Sunday. Um, it is Tuesday. We're five days out from stepping on stage. So, we we are testing, we're basically testing the carb load today. Because ideally, you want to do that before you get on stage, right? Before the show comes. If you don't do it before the show comes and you're doing it on show day, it's just like a little bit of a little bit, I don't want to play guessing games. I'm gonna do about 10 grams of this because I just want the crunchy stuff. Okay. All he gets. <laughs> I'm gonna add some cinnamon. Cinnamon is a prebiotic, which I recently discovered, which helps you digest your food and absorb the carbs better. A little bit more cinnamon. A little bit of salt. This is literally going to be fucking heaven. I can't even tell you guys how great I am right now. 50 grams of data. We are going to weigh absolutely everything today. The new macros in the meal are 24 grams of protein, 78 grams of carbs, and 11 grams of fat. I'm so fucking happy, you have no idea. I'm looking for 14 grams of peanut butter, which, when you actually measure it, is only that much. It's not very much. Actually, what we're going to do is a little spectacular learn from Brandon Harding. Make your butter last a little bit longer. You do that, and you add a tiny little bit of water. Only a little bit. Toss in the microwave. 15 seconds, literally. Adds a little bit more volume to it. Get a little bit more bang for your buck. Hell yeah. I'm gonna shake your first bite with you guys and then leave me the fuck alone. I've been waiting for that my whole life. See you guys at the next meal. Oh, hey, it's me. I'm doing 75 grams of oats. <laughs> what is life? Are you kidding me right now? Great day. So I'm only gonna do a little bit of uh, protein. I'm gonna keep my protein sources super clean still um, because you know, I'm carb loading, but I wanna make sure that I'm maintaining like my usual diet and I'm just like adding some freaking carbs. So we are going to make uh, 150 grams of egg whites. Make sure we keep our protein sources clean. I'm also, I'm also gonna keep my veggies super low today, which is something that I don't usually do because I usually eat lots of veggies for volume, but today, volume is not the goal. Um, I'm not trying to fill my stomach up. So when you're carb loading, you don't need lots of veggies. You can, if anything, veggies will make you blow. What you're gonna do, 85 grams of oats, 
uh, like a quarter scoop of protein powder. I'm gonna let that cook up. Okay, so 150 grams. So it should be 800. Sorry, it should be 7, 790. I'm gonna lightly season it. We'll add some honey garlic sweet barbecue. That sounds fucking fire. Look how much fucking oatmeal it is right now. <laughs> and, of course, gotta do our 10 grams of cereal. Stevia, cinnamon, help with digestion. I'm very particular about my oatmeal consistency. It has to be a certain consistency. Kristen actually hates making me food because, well, she hates making me oats when I'm on prep because I'm like so fucking picky. This week I've been literally like consuming like peak wheat bought from like high level men's physique competitors. And whenever you carb load, you want to keep your veggies down because you do not want to bloat. Um, so macros for the day, 150 grams of protein, 400 grams of carbs, 60 grams of fat. We also are gonna monitor it, and at the end of the day, if I do feel like I need more carbs, or if Dawn feels like I need more carbs, we're gonna do a load at the end of the day. I'm gonna do some almond butter. I'm gonna do 16 grams of almond butter. Doing our little water trick. I wanna make that almond butter last, yo. Thanks, Brandon Harding. If you guys don't follow Brandon Harding, you should. He's fire. Oh yeah. Enjoy that shit. I'm gonna do my 50 grams of banana. Last time I did a banana, it was 50 grams and it was the exact same size, so I know that this is gonna be 50 grams as well. Another thing that I've been learning from bodybuilders is like, I used to avoid fruits during carb ups, but um, a lot of the high level bodybuilders that I follow, men's physique competitors, usually have like blueberries or bananas in their uh, carb loads, so I am just shutting the fuck up and doing what everybody else does, because success leaves clues. Let's eat. All right, so right now my macros are at 146 grams of carbs, 56 grams of protein, and 25 grams of fat. Let's eat. We now have a toaster, and I want some toast. So I'm hoping this doesn't taste like asshole, but we'll see. Right now I'm gonna have two slices of bread. It is three bakers, white, whole grain. Two slices of bread and some jam. Cause I'm a little bit snack. Sugar-free jam. Honestly, it could, could taste good. You don't know. Well, for a bit of spread. We shall see, you guys. Don't know how it's gonna be. I'll keep you posted. I got this bread because it's two slices. It's fucking 140 calories. Sign me up for that. Yes, I will. Yes, I motherfucking will. Anything else you wanna say? Is that it? Nope, down the hatch. All right, so. It is meal, technically meal three time. I'm actually trying to eat my calories a little bit earlier in the day because I've been eating them later at night. My morning weight's been higher, so I'm gonna eat them earlier in the day. Uh, next meal is going to be uh, jasmine rice, or so it's like white rice and chicken. So I've never tried this white rice, and hopefully it's not fucking nasty because that would suck. So I'm gonna do four ounces of chicken. I'm gonna have a little bit of mushrooms cause, just because I love them. I do love me some mush, guys. So that is the next meal. I'll tell you guys what the macros are at after this meal. Macros after this meal, 85 grams of protein, 230 grams of carbs, and 29 grams of fat. Kitchen's a fucking mess, guys. Kitchen's a mess, don't give a fuck at all. And then, I'm gonna fry up the rice because it'll taste way better. Add a little bit of onion seasoning. That was not a little. <laughs> Whatever. It's a good day. It's a good day to have a good day. I know. Oh, I'm so excited. I love carb loading. After all the fucking suffering this week, this is great. Oh shit, I need to drink my water too. I'm trying to keep my water intake up. So, I'm not trying, I'm succeeding at it. So. Before each meal, chug one of these. Helps with satiating too. Mm. You feel more fuller, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Look at that. That's great. It took a total of five minutes. Yep. Fuck cool. yeah. A little bit of mustard and we're good. Let's eat. Too. You got for you? This is for you. Oh, you. Yeah.
Your gym bag and your matching hat just need one. You're so, you're so cute. Brian got me a gym bag. Thank you. I'm gonna give my husband a kiss. Thank you, he got me a gym bag. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna eat meal four, um, which is potatoes, egg whites, and I got, I did get veggies because honestly, I'm like really fucking hungry and that's because I haven't eaten any fiber. So I need something to keep me satiated. So I'll show you guys the meal. It's fucking delicious. And then I'm gonna smash it. Offland, by the way, 10 out of 10 would recommend. How fucking good does that look? Yeah. And sugar-free barbecue sauce. I'm actually starving, so. It's a thing like when you haven't eaten fucking carbs in so long, you like when you start eating them, your body's just like, baby. So I'm going to absolutely smash this. And this. All right, guys, I'm gonna have the first bite, and then I'm gonna eat this shit. Oh my god, I'm so excited right now. <sighs> Thank the fucking Lord. I'm very happy right now. All right. Bye guys. All right, you guys, we are on to meal four. I was craving a little bit of sweet and a little bit of savory. So I've got hundred grams of rice. I am craving some vegetables too. It's actually good that my body's craving vegetables. So I'm happy with that. Um, so a little bit of sweet, a little bit of savory. Here's what we did. I got some uh, toast, some uh, my peanut butter, like I told you guys earlier. Make it go a little bit, make it last a little bit. Oh, uh, well, I guess. Let's go a little bit farther. So some sugar free jam. And spread this across both pieces of toast here. This is gonna be my next meal and I'm excited about it. As always, gonna have the first bite with you guys and then I'm gonna fucking devour because I'm fucking hungry. A bit of stevia, some water for after my meal. I already chugged the water from before the meal. Boom. Mustard. And this. This is my next meal. Actually, you guys don't need to see the first bite. Just show them a fucking sick old B-roll of that. Enjoy, friend. Time to eat. This puts my macros for the day at 136 protein, 350 carb, and 45 fat. That's where I'm at for the day so far. All right, y'all. So, we are five days out and doing some walking on the treadmill. I want to talk a little bit about how this prep has been a little bit different in the sense that, you know, obviously, if you've been following the YouTube, you've seen me grind it out over the course of the last three weeks. My weight not dropping and being super stressed about it, dealing with all that adversity while running the businesses and then deciding to take a step back from the businesses so I can just focus on the prep. But coming into this final week, it's like I feel different. Honestly, I feel really confident that I'm going to win the show. And, you know, previously in preps, it's almost been like in the last week I had this like sense of desperation to like do a little bit more than I need to do in order to win, but I just feel super at peace. It's like everything that I could have done to get to this point, I've done. There's not a single thing that I would have done differently on this prep, you know? It's like, especially like running the businesses and like the level that I played at while running the businesses, it's like, man, I just know that nobody's put in the level of work ethic, ethic that I put into this fucking prep. There's not a single fucking person that's worked at the capacity that I've worked for the duration of time that I've worked. And for that reason, like, I believe that that overall trophy belongs to me. After I competed in the last show, I was going full speed, and then there was a few setbacks, and caused me to have to take a step back from the prep a little bit. And then the last three weeks, I've been like operating at like 120%. And now, in the final week, I can like slow down the pace a little bit and land the plane. So, these next few days are about like decreasing my stress levels, and just like decreasing inflammation, so and decreasing the intensity of my cardio so that my body can absorb all the nutrients that I'm putting in so that I can fill up and take home the trophy. I put everything that I possibly could into this prep and I truly do believe that this is my time. And now, we're just gonna let the universe decide if it is my time.
fried rice and roasted broccoli. This is going to be one of my last meals of the day. Um, I'm going to do this in my fitness pal. I feel really fucking good, you guys. You just saw the posing. I feel super confident. This is my hot dawn. Said carbs are definitely hitting right today. Your shoulders right. are looking Set. fucking fire. Thanks, G. Sitting at 175 protein. I went over my protein a little bit. I'm, I don't think Don will care. 52 grams of fat and 392 grams of carbs. He honestly might give me some more carbs though. I honestly feel like I could handle more carbs. My body's like fucking. Just good. Um, I feel really fucking confident, you guys. I feel really good. Um, I was telling Arnell, like, it sounds weird to say, but I feel like I already won the show. So, we'll see, man. Just gonna let time catch up and gonna finish these last few days strong and really focus on like decreasing the intensity and just like landing the plane, you know? The fucking hard, hard work is done. Now it's time to land the plane and stay dialed in on the little details and uh, step on stage and showcase all the hard work that I've been putting in for these last 10 months. Oh, baby, I'm so excited. I agree, I think my waist looks better, my shoulders feel better, I just feel overall, yeah. I feel overall, like I feel really good about where I'm at. Yeah, man, like uh, just like your top shelf looks super conditioned and dry. Yeah. Like your shoulders, your chest, I'm just watching your videos again right here. Yeah. And your back, your back is looking awesome too. Yeah, thanks G. What are your macros now? Now 392 carb, 170 protein and 50 fat. Hold on. For like a two hour like window okay. before your next meal. And for this next meal, I would go like a hundred grams worth of meat. Okay. Do you like a 200 gram portion of rice, potatoes, or uh, whatever else you have what, prepared? What about creamy rice? Creamy rice works too, yeah. Okay. So we're looking for uh, like 40 ish, 40 to 50 grams of carbs. For fats, like if you want to add in some fats, you can, but if you don't want it for your next meal, just have more veggies. Okay. So guys, that uh, is almost a wrap on the day. Final meal is coming up soon, so I'll show you guys the final meal. Not gonna lie, 12 out of 10 excited he told me that I could have another meal. Ha-ching! All right, you guys. So, we are on the last meal. I am craving some vegetables. So, I'm gonna do veggies and cream of rice. And I'll show you guys the finished product. All right, you guys. That is it. As a full day of eating, we ended up at 450 grams of carbs, 200 grams of protein, and 60 grams of fat. Hopefully you enjoyed this vlog. We're five days out, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.